Hi, this is Mike with Stalls TV, and today we're going to look at changing the offset settings on your Roland GX24 and why you would need to do that. What the offset does, first off, is it measures the distance of the tip of the blade to the center of the blade. And with a Roland, you have two options, a 45 degree and a 60 degree. Now, obviously, those blades have a different angle, so they're going to have different starting points and midpoints. So, to do that, with a 45 degree blade first, its offset is 0.25. And with a 60 degree blade, you're changing that to a 0.4. And what that's going to do is going to better negotiate corners and curves and things of that nature. So let's go take a look at the cutter here and how to change the offset. Right now, we currently have a 45 degree blade in there. So if we hit the menu, do you see unsetup? And then we're going to hit down until we see condition and hit to the right, we have our force, hit down, speed, hit down, and now we see offset. Like I said, we have a 45 degree blade in here at a 0.25 offset. And a 45 degree blade, you're using that for 95% of everything, sign vinyl, heat transfer vinyl, uh, and, and relatively thin materials. So if we were to change a 60 degree blade in here for cutting items such as tackle twill, glitter flake, reflective, things that are a little bit thicker in nature, we would want to change that offset. So to do that, just hit to the right, hit up, until you get to 0.4, and then once you're at 0.4, you hit enter. And then now, we've just changed our offset to a uh, 0.4 for a 60 degree blade. And you would do the same thing if you were changing back to a 45 degree blade to remember to change it back to uh, 0.25. Typically, those are the only reasons that you're changing your offset because you're changing the blades. But let's say you're cutting something and you know your corners on your squares are a little round instead of nice and sharp. Typically, if you see rounded corners on a square, that means your offset is set too low. You know, so to, to, to do that, just go back in your offset and raise it a little bit and do another test cut and make sure you get a nice uh, sharp angles on your squares. And conversely, if you're cutting and you see horns on the squares where it, it, like it overcuts and comes back, you know, typically that means your offset is set too high. And again, you can go back into the condition and uh, change that offset to lower it to remedy that. You know, so that essentially is uh, why you're changing your offset and how you do that on the Roland GX24.